Hello everybody, my name is Sir Raphael and I will be teaching you environmental studies. Now everybody take out your Wonder World Environmental Studies Book 1 and turn with me to the second lesson. My body on page 5. Is everybody ready? Right, let us begin. One, two, three. My body. Our body has different parts. Each part does something special. Now look at look at the boy below. Can you can you can everybody see the boy below? Yes. Now look at all the different parts of the body that are being pointed out. With the hair, the eye, the mouth, the elbow, the stomach, the thigh, the leg, the foot, the toes, the head, the ear, the nose, the face, the neck, shoulder, arms, hand, fingers, chest, knee and heel. Now, everybody will have to learn all of the parts of the body. Do you already know all of the parts of the body? If you do, very good. Now, let us move on. Page 6. Stand in front of a mirror. How many of the body part, how many of the following body parts do you have? And write the numbers in the boxes. Look at the clown for help. Now, look at all the different parts of the body. Hands, head, fingers, nose, feet, eyes, knees and mouth. How many of these body parts do you have? Now, I will be doing one with you and you will have to do the rest for homework. Hands. How many hands do you have? Do you have one hand? Two hands? Three hands? Or maybe even five hands? How many hands do you have? Mm, that's right, you have only two hands. So, in the box, you write two. Very good. Now, you will be completing the rest for homework. That's right. Now, on to the next. How our body parts help us? Different parts of the body help us to do different things. Now, let's take our hands. Do you use your hands to do anything? We use our hands to do many things, like brush your teeth. Do you use your feet to brush your teeth? How many of you use your hair to brush your teeth? Do you use your eyes to brush your teeth? No, we use our hands. Very good. So we use, your, we use our hands to brush our teeth. Write a letter. Yes, we use our hands for that. Hold a bat. Throw a ball. Eat food. Pick up things. Mm, we use our hands to do these many things and so so many more can you think of any other thing you do with your hands what else do you do with your hands mm, do, do you do you do you eat food with your hands yes do you drink water with your hands do you hold the glass with your hands do you what else do you do with your hands mm. now on to the next page Page number seven. Now look at the exercise above. Let's do it. Put your hand on a sheet of paper. Spread the fingers and draw the outline of each finger. Learn the names of each finger. Ask your teacher for help. Can you say which finger is the longest? Which finger is the smallest? Right, so I will be helping you with this one. Now, everybody pay attention. This is your thumb. Everybody put, out, put up your thumbs. Yes, that is your thumb. Now, the next. This is your index finger or also called pointer finger. Everybody put up index fingers. Yes, we point with our index fingers. Or it's also called the pointer finger. The spelling for index is I-N-D-E-X. Very good. Now let us look at the next finger. This is your middle finger. Right. 
it is <coughs> it is right in the middle of all of your fingers right in the middle that's why it's called the middle finger next mm, that is your ring finger hmm maybe if you look at mommy or daddy's finger you will find you may or may not find a ring that, that is where we wear rings hence the name ring finger it is just next to the middle finger everybody put up your ring fingers yes very good and this is your pinky finger it is the last finger on your hand it is also the smallest finger can everybody put up your pinky fingers p i n k y pinky mm very good now everybody complete the exercise can you say which finger is the longest and can you, which finger is the smallest which finger is the longest look at all of your fingers which finger is the longest and which finger is the smallest fill in the blanks very good now on to the next legs we can do many things with our legs hmm where are your legs how many legs do you have do you have one leg do you have three legs do you have four legs how many legs do you have hmm we have we all have two legs now what do we do with our legs we stand we walk we jump we dance hmm now look at the exercise below can you write two more things that we do with our legs hmm what else what else do you do with your legs two things yep complete the exercise two things two more things that we do with our legs now did you know the different parts of our feet have different names now look at your feet where are your feet hmm they are the bottom they are the lowest part of your body right look at your feet everybody look at your feet you have your toes you have your big toe you have your little toe you have your ankle and you have your heel these are the different parts of the feet now that concludes the lesson for today my name is sir rafael and thank you for joining us see you next time bye bye